Okay, so what is going on here is this. Okay, as you notice that the logic that works here is the same logic that works here. So what is going on here is that uh, the values that we are putting in the, setting, the settings area there in order to control these buttons um, actually are stored in the t-login. So each user has got uh, 12 areas where the admin can assign uh, specific forms that the user can have access to or not to have access to. Okay. Um, okay. And then when the when that user logs in, is that um, there's a code which fits, uh, which is going to collect that information uh, for that user and it's going to put that information here. Okay, so what is going on here is that this text box is form one. So this is the form that is going to be opened. And then this one holds the value that is form name, that is the caption that is going to be on the button. So um, this button here receives values from this. Okay, so the caption uh, is going to, this value which is gonna be here is gonna be the caption for the button. And then this, is going to hold the name of the form, which I hear one of, maybe your forms are going to show up here, the name of the form that you do want uh, to open when you click on that button, okay? So, so when you go at the back of this form on the, on the onload, this is, this is the code, this is the code here. Okay, so the first thing that happens is that when the form loads, so the first thing that happens is that when the form loads, it's going to collect, um, it's going to look for that user uh, who was, uh, was logged in and then get the name of the person. And then after that, it's going to find out in the, in the system if, uh, the user has access to the button that is the setting button. Um, and then after that, then it's going to do now the, the feeding, uh, the feeding in of the, the values uh, in those text, uh, in those text box uh, for that specific user. Okay. And then after that, the navigation uh, the navigation panel also is going to be it's going to be uh, it's going to be filled up with the information that we have uh, that we have put in the setting area so that is what is going on there um and then on each button here let me just check and um, this is the code that is just a simple code okay so if we're saying so if uh, middle form 12 is now then throw up that message and then but if there's something there then open that form okay so as you can see that these are the ones so the form 12 is this this is a text box so when you click on here uh, it's going to look for the value that is here and then whatever form that we have assigned in the setting area is going to be opened this one is going to be for the caption for this button here all right, so that is what is going on with uh, this, this template. Okay. All right, thank you very much for your patience. Um, God bless.